I'm whispering because there's people sleeping behind me, behind that wall. And this is my breakfast. Cornflakes and uh, oats. And I'll eat a lot because I don't know when I can eat again or when I can buy stuff. That's the, the name of the place I was st and the stamp I got. And this is the uh, kitchen area. as you saw yesterday with the lake and everything and uh, I'm ready to go today it will be a shorter day it should be about or a little less than 20 kilometers so I'm stoked if I can get uh, a time and just relax a bit in. so guys time is about 6 30 woke up a little earlier than I did last last few days and uh, another beautiful day ahead about to start my walk down that way. Yeah, I kind of just hope that it's a shorter one today. Just feel like not walking a whole lot. Last couple of days has been a little long. I mean, yesterday I first came in at almost five o'clock, I think. Which is all good. I mean, there's no problem with it. It's just how it went. And I feel pretty, pretty, pretty good. A bit tired and it's like I don't really don't sleep. I don't really feel I sleep more than a few hours a night. It's kind of weird. But I still feel like I have a lot of energy. So who knows why that is. But I think walking just stim stimulates you a lot in your head, brain, body, minds. All that good stuff. Anyways, I'll be on my way. Take some pictures along the way. Let you know. Alone on the road. So now you can just walk on it and be careless about traffic. That is a hill. I don't like hills. Walking into Nurse Anita. Maybe it's good that it's not Nurse Ape. Walking in to get some veggies and uh, food for the next couple of days. This is a sunny part of Denmark, as you can see. Yeah, very sunny. What's up? Stocked up some on some fruit. Now I can continue. Feeling a little heavier in my backpack, but better to get some fruit. I ate some oats with real milk, cow milk, and it's, my stomach doesn't doesn't like that. So I need some whole foods. Just got out of Nurzniti. Nurse needed, and uh, I'm in the f pine forest now, and sort of packed up with some fruit and stuff. I have my box of rice. I don't know if that's good anymore. It seemed okay this morning, but I'm gonna have a can of beans. So it might be a really boring dinner, but I think there is a place where I can buy some stuff just before the shelter tonight or the. Albergue, it seems like it has private shelters or private whatever, so um, let's see how that, how that goes. Um, I feel like just getting done with the day, to be honest, just a short day, and so I can just relax. And, and I just got to thinking of, you know, I don't really feel like stopping, and of course, why would I stop? I have set out on this journey, but... I don't have a goal. I mean, the, the magical experience of actually ending up in Finisterra, northwest coast of Spain, that is such a beautiful thought. Um, but I mean, I'm thinking about what's, what's happening, of course, just reflecting on stuff. And there is a deer. See the deer? <laughs> Curious. Funny. <laughs> Doesn't seem that scared. Not 
that's sort of gone. <laughs> Funny. <clears throat> but I didn't. I'm not reflecting on stuff, so I'm not. Of course, you know, I might just just kind of uh, just checking in with myself. You know, am I? What, how do I? What's the state? You know, status. Um, yeah, I don't feel like stopping. I feel there is a fire in my stomach. I feel like there's a fire to continue. Uh, fire to to explore this, whatever it is, um, and just open to what can happen. Um, as I said in my number one or zero video before I started walking the day before, there's three sort of main reasons why I am walking in some sense. I really have a big wish for a relationship, a healthy relationship, one I can have a family with, you know. Um, and that's been like that for a while, but it really is something I would really, really enjoy and like. The other is, uh, find a, or, you know, build on a career or build on what I want to do for a living for myself. And of course I have many ideas as a writer, uh, I really want to help people some way, you know, I feel I have some expertise with meditation and other things. And I also, I also, uh, so that's, those are the two things. And then those two things I'd like to put on a, <laughs> in, in a place that's called home. A place where I love to be, love to live around nature, quiet. And, uh where I can maybe grow a garden or have a basketball hoop or, you know. That's so weird. These signs, markers sometimes, they're not not very good. Okay, I'm pausing here. That was my sense for that, that, was that reflection. <laughs> Destination, just a kilometer or two away. The town itself is about a kilometer and then it looks like the place to stay is, is a bit further. But my goal right now is just to get to the town near the store that there there are, and perhaps get some uh, get some food. Uh, maybe there is a restaurant, or I don't know. Some when you walk the fa fast food or any food, it doesn't. I don't care. Like compared to when I when I'm staying, you know, in a place for a while, you know, I have my I have the things I eat, but. Uh, when I'm out walking, I, I eat everything because it's simply about energy and and yeah. Yesterday we had a, I had a pizza, which was definitely not enough. This morning I ate milk with uh, just ugh. yeah, not good. So uh, yeah, soon arriving, and I hope that that place is nice. I. Uh, it's only like 11, 11.30 right now. And if I can have, yeah, day and a half of rest, that would be really, really nice. My shoulders are really killing me today. The, uh, yeah, right here, a bit of agony there. So, but I've added a few kilograms too with the fruit and everything. So that's probably why. Bit tough today. What's up, guys? Just arrived at the location, and uh, all these cabins are up for grabs. Cabins, and this is the kitchen and info area. And this is my house. 
危ない。